We have news about the scandal that toppled the CIA director, former General David Petraeus. ABC's Brian Ross looked into this question. Did the two women involved in the scandal try to make a profit off their ties to powerful officers? Here's the Brian Ross investigation. In addition to the book and the sex, Paula Broadwell's connection with General David Petraeus provided another benefit a celebrity status in military circles that led to a role as an expert commentator and firing range demonstrator on an infomercial for a company trying to gain military contracts for their strange-looking, lightweight machine guns. On the individual fighter, reducing weight is, is critical. On this tape, shot last December in the midst of her affair with the four-star general running the CIA, Broadwell is identified as the author of the Petraeus biography. In a previous infomercial six years ago, she had no speaking part and simply demonstrated the gun. Officials at the company, located in Virginia Beach, said Broadwell has no official affiliation with them, but would not answer ABC News questions about why they chose to use her as a spokesperson. But watchdog groups say the use of Broadwell was a brilliant move by a company seeking an edge in Washington. People did not have to know she was his mistress. They knew that he was friends with her. So anyone in the agencies would know that this is someone Petraeus is going to be favorable towards. And Broadwell is not the only woman who seems to have tried to benefit from her ties to General Petraeus. Tampa socialite Jill Kelly allegedly used the CIA director's name in an effort this summer to broker a contract for a $4 billion energy facility with senior officials of the South Korean government, according to New York businessman Adam Victor. Ms. Kelly made it clear to me uh, that General Petraeus put her in, uh, in this position, and that's why uh, she was able to have access to such senior levels that they were essentially doing a favor for General Petraeus. Victor said he broke off dealing with Kelly after she asked for a commission of about $80 million. There was no comment today from Jill Kelly, but a source close to General Petraeus said tonight he had nothing whatsoever to do with any such deal and that he had asked Jill Kelly to stop throwing his name around so much. And General Petraeus, Petraeus had a comment today. Yes, he said, and he reiterated he did not provide any classified information to his mistress, Paula Broadwell. And that, in fact, uh, he has said that because now the inspector general at the CIA has said he is opening a new and full investigation of the general's conduct while at the CIA. He has said, though, he did not do did not. that. Thank you, Brian.